Morning year 11. Okay, how does length of wire affect resistance? Here's your setup for today's practical. You've got a huge long bit of wood there. Can you see that with a wire attached to it? And the, the met on the wire is called constantan. You've got a meter ruler next to that. We've then got two cells, your voltmeter, V for voltmeter, your ammeter, and a switch. The switch is attached to the constantan wire using a crocodile clip like that, okay? And basically, the experiment is lovely and simple. The first thing we should do is take a potential difference reading so that we can find out what the voltage being given to circuit is by our cells. So you can see we've got 1.0, oh, oh well, let's say we've got one volt going into our circuit there. And you want to make sure that you take note of that so you record that in your table then um, you can see our ammeter which is connected in series is just there and all we do is we move our crocodile clip so that it is let's say 10 centimeters from the other connector so we've got 10 centimeters worth of constant hand there we press our switch and we take a current reading which is one point what's that 1.37 we'll say Okay, and you record that in your results table. We then take the crocodile clip, we move it to 20 centimetres. And again, press our switch, take a reading, record it, and again. And I'll go up in 10 centimetres. I would say to the end of the constant hand that you might be limited by how far your red lead stretches. We'll take as many readings as we can, taking the current at different lengths of constant and recording it each time. All right, off you go.